Welcome back, Thirsties! In this video, another opa will be featured in our KISS series. Lee Dong-wook. He's actually 40 years old, not 39 anymore. And he's on the industry for 22 years. Like OMG. Let's go back to his K-drama kisses from the very start. So prepare your emotions, Thirsties! Because this is going to be one hot ride. Inhale, exhale. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe in order for you to get updated on the hottest trending man on the planet. He Videos and pictures are not mine. No copyright infringement intended. This is a commentary. Enjoy watching Thirsties! Let's start this list with Hanoi Bride. I'm sure most of you are not familiar with this K-drama. It was actually on 2005. Yes, Lee dong Hook was so young by the time and I'm actually on elementary days during that time. How about you, Thursdays? Unfortunately, we don't have much kissing scenes here. Just a smack on lips, just like that. Next we have School 2. This is an even older K-drama, actually Thursdays. It was shown on 1999 to 2000. Yes! And he was part of episodes 32 to episode 42. And he played the role Lee kang San. And his character is kind of rebellious this gay drama. Next we have the story of Kang Gu. Oh my god, look at Lee Dong Wook's face on that scene. He was really so hot, right, Thursdays? That's all I can comment. Actually, the story of Kang Gu is some kind of a recent gay drama already because it's shown on 2014. And Lee Dong Hook's kissing scenes will never fail. Next, we have Peter Sweet Life. Hold on to this scene, Thirsties. Yes, it's a May December love affair. And during this time, Lee Dong Hook was so skinny, but he's delivering us, he's giving us with so much hotness when it comes to this scene. Yes, look at that, Thursdays. This K-drama was actually shown on 2008 on NBC. Next, we have Partner. Shown on 2009 on KBS2. And let's just praise how Lee Dong Wook's portrayal when it comes to wearing suit and tie is just superb yes it fits him so well right Thursdays wild romance it was shown on 2012 on KBS 2 a story about the love-hate relationship of an obnoxious superstar professional baseball player and his tomboyish bodyguard if you haven't watched this Thursdays, this is actually an underrated K-drama. And this is so good. The romantic comedy side of Lee Dong Wook is just heart finger. You will love him. Next we have Life. The series aired on JTBC and also available for streaming on Netflix. Unfortunately, the kissing scene in this series is not pushed through. In 3, 2, 1. Okay, let's just wait a little bit, Thursdays. Yeah, there's someone there. And now we have Bubblegum. This series actually popularized the Bubblegum kiss. 
Yes, because whenever Lee Dong Wook kiss the female lead, she has a bubble gum on her lips. And look at that one. So, I would love to be a bubble gum. Hi, Lee Dong Wook. Let's also praise him when it comes to his kissing prowess. He's really a good kisser. I can say that. There's this. Now we have the fugitive of Joseon. One of Lee Dong Wook's highly acclaimed performance, his acting in this series on 2013 was actually praised by critics because he is really good. Unfortunately, he has no kissing scene in this series. But if you happen to watch it, Thursdays, watch it now. Scent of a Woman This 2011 K-drama received a lot of praises and was shown internationally in different countries such as Philippines, Sri Lanka, aside from other countries. And Lee Dong Hook's kissing prowess was another showcase in this K-drama. He is really good in kissing scene. I must say there's this. And now let's have Blade Man, a fantasy series that starred Lee Dong Wook and Shin Se Kyung, aired on KBS2 on November 2014. They actually have a good chemistry, but the kissing scenes are actually shot on far angle. Yes, unfortunately. Look at this one, it's so far. We can't appreciate his lips. Right, Thursdays? And now, our favorite of Lee Dong Wook's K drama, My Girl. After so many years in the industry, this K drama catapulated the stardom of Lee Dong Wook as a Hallyu star in South Korea and anywhere in the world. And let's just say their love story in My Girl is superb. Plus, the kissing scenes, all I can say, is so romantic and perfectly made. Let's move on to Hotel King. Another 2014 drama series. Yes, Lee Dong Wook created a lot of K-drama on 2014. He is really a bankable actor. This is actually their reunion with Lee Da He, who he previously worked with in My Girl on 2005. He's just so sexy. Touch Your Heart Based on web novel shown on 2019 and available on streaming on Netflix starring Lee Dong Wook and Yu In Ah. This drama made him known on this generation. Yes, Lee Dong Wook is unstoppable when it comes to his kissing scenes and K-dramas. The Tale of the Nine Tailed, another personal favorite of Lee Dong Wook's K-dramas. I actually love the fantasy and the romance theme of this series and the kissing scenes are just superb. It's just so pure. And when it comes to fantasy roles, Lee Dong Wooks are really nailing his character, especially as a nine tailed fox. And speaking of fantasy, here we go Guardian, the lonely and great god. Oh my god, who would forget his character here as the Grim Reaper? We just so love his character. And how he kissed his uni. And here's our February giveaway for you, Thursdays. You have a chance to win 1,000 pesos or 20 USD plus Park Sojun and Ji Chang Wook merch. Just subscribe, hit the notification bell, and comment down below. And of course, like our videos in order for you to have a chance to win. Thank you for watching Thursdays!